Yo, what is up guys? It's me, Camera Boy, back here today. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, this is a um special edition type drink that we are trying today. Yep. What's what is it called? Okay, this is Coca-Cola Creations, and this is Coke Bite. It's a limited edition flavor. It says taste. The okay. magic of pixels. You can only get this on the Coke website. That's right. You can only get this on Coke's website. You have to order it from them and have it delivered. You can't buy it in stores. It's also zero sugar. Okay, so it's the only version they make. It's zero sugar Coke bite. Okay, comes in this really cool packaging here. It's like, got some... Uh, kind of like a video game style. Yeah, it's like got a like video game style. Or Mar or the, Mario. You can see the font is like this kind of like old school 8-bit... Uh, font here it says coca-cola on it. All right, let's open this package and see what's inside here All right. All right. Look at that. Yeah, look at this cool cool lid here Okay, that almost kind of reminds me of like a video game inside. There's some stuff in here. There's a couple things in here Let's see what we got Okay, got like a sticker. We got a cool sticker. Oh wait, Reflective. there's like a note and there's a note in here. Let's see what uh, what the note says here. It says, inspired by the humble and iconic pixel, Coca-Cola Zero Sugar Bite celebrates the friendships and connections that are the essence of gaming. So this is like gaming inspired. It says, take a sip and taste the pixels. We hope you share it with others. Well, and we are. Yeah, me and Kamek Boy are gonna share it with each other here, see? Okay? The thing is, uh, you said that this was like, Somewhat inspired by uh, Fortnite, right? I thought I read something about Fortnite. Like maybe there's something within Fortnite that references this. So uh, we'll see what what happens here. Uh, let's uh, lift open this uh, flap here and see what's inside. Set this aside. Okay. Here we got the cans. Inside we got two cans. It says player one and player two. Player one, player two. It. Like, kind of like Ready Player One. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it, it really does... This almost re reminds me of, like, a game. It. I would say it almost reminds me of a game called S System Shock. I'm not familiar with it. It's, um... And not many people are really familiar with it. It's... Uh, it's... Not, I think it's somewhat of a popular game, but... Yeah. Okay. Well, anyway, it's got this font. It's like 8-bit pixel font here. Old school. It's a nice uh, light purple can here. Um, so, zero calories because it's zero sugar. So, that's nice. So, uh, we're going to get ready to crack these open, and we're going to pour them into the Coca-Cola glasses. Hey! We've got the Coca-Cola product going into a Coke yeah. glassware change, right? <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's open these up. All right. Oh, I can see some steam. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's pour this in our glasses. Ooh, I can smell it from here. It has yeah, like a distinct smell here. I can, too. It's very strong, the smell. It's a good smell, though. It's not a bad smell. All right. Let's, let's smell right. this. See, see, see what I can detect here. Hmm. It's very fruity smelling. Yeah, I feel like a little bit of some fizz. Probably the bubbles hitting your nose. Yeah. It's very fruity, very strong, fruity smelling. All right. Are you ready to take a drink? Yeah, let's get ready to try this. Okay, on the All count right. of three. One, one two, two, three. three. Sip. Yeah, that deserves another sip. Hmm. I mean, I can't even describe that really. It's like to me, it's almost. It almost kind of feels like. Um. To me, it almost feels like. Uh. Blueberry mixed with like somewhat of cherry sometimes. That's a good description. That's actually a very good description. I, I was going to say cherry Coke. It has that taste of cherry Coke, but it's still a little bit different. 
Yeah. Not like straight up cherry Coke. I tell you, I like this better than regular Coke Zero Sugar. The, you know, I'm not sure if you can feel this, but to me, I felt like something was like dissolving in my, you know, my tongue. Mm -hmm. I think it's like because, you know, considering that there's pixels, it's like, you know, pixels can somewhat... Uh, it's pixel themed. Like it, yeah, it's, pixels can somewhat look like they're dissolving. So I... And I felt like something was like dissolving. You know what I've heard some people describe with this? Some people say like it reminds, like the sensation is kind of like pop rocks on their tongue. You know how pop rocks like, they kind of like pop on your tongue. I'm not really getting that. I don't um, think it, it. It does have a little bit of fizz that, you know, kind of lingers and then it kind of dissolves away pretty quick. I think the reason why I'm like feeling like a little bit of some uh, blueberry in it you know? is because... You know how you were saying that you heard something of that this might be inspired by something from Fortnite? Yeah. There's this thing in Fortnite called Shield Potion, and it's blue. Okay. And some people say is that, you know, the Shield Potion kind of tastes like blueberries. So. Okay. This <laughs> might actually be what it's referencing as for the Shield Potion. Considering I have a little bit of mix of some like blueberry plus cherry in it. I'm kind of getting that too. I think you're right. I think it, it de well, you definitely taste the cherry, but there's something else going on and I couldn't quite put my finger well, on it. I mean, I also get a mix of something else, but I can't quite think of it on the, on the top of my head. It. I can't remember what it was. That's okay. It almost like... To me, there's like somewhat of like cotton candy, I think. You think cotton it. candy? Yeah. Okay. But there's also some other thing, but I can't remember what it is. Okay. All right. Well, I think, I think you're spot on. I think it definitely tastes like cherry with a little hint of maybe blueberry. Um... That's, that's probably a pretty accurate description. I think it's pretty good. Um, the more I drink it, the more I'm kind of tasting the uh, artificial sweeteners, um, you know, that most zero sugar products have. Um, so I don't think I could like drink this as part of my regular arsenal, but it's definitely an interesting special edition drink to try. Yeah, I mean, we we also have a, uh, two more boxes of these. Yeah, we have a couple more boxes. We're gonna share them with some friends, get their thoughts, see what they think about maybe it. Maybe we might can. Maybe we can probably do a video of like some. We could bring some friends along, and in that video, is their thoughts on yeah the drink. Maybe okay. Um, we ready to give it a score? Yeah. How about you go first? Okay. Um, hmm. I'm gonna give a Coke bite. A 6.5. It doesn't bite. It's not great, but it's not bad. 6.5 for me. Kamek, what are you giving it? Okay, I have to ask why 6.5. <laughs> it just, it, it falls in that range for me. Okay. Um, here, how about I have a couple more slips? Okay. Kamek needs a couple more sips before he can give a score. All right. Excuse me. Um, my final score. Yeah, I don't want to do that one. Um, I'm gonna give the score of ten out of ten. 10 out of 10? You think it's that good? So you like it as much as, say, Maui Burst, which you also gave a 10 out of 10 to. Well, Maui Burst is like, it's Mountain Dew. Maui, that's like my ultimate Mountain Dew favorite. Like, that's my ultimate favorite for Mountain Dew. Okay. This is probably, I mean, I want to say this is my ultimate favorite. Because I mean, that, uh, there's a lot of Cokes. But you're giving it a 10 out of 10. That means it's perfect for you. I know, but I I like giving Cokes 10 out of 10 because okay. they have a good flavor. Okay. This does have a good flavor. Um, 
I like how it does reference some things with like um, video games, kind of like Sonic the Hedgehog or Mario. It's, it tastes a little bit of blueberry and cherry. I have somewhat of a mix of cotton candy, but there is something else that I can't quite think of. But overall, I will give this a 10 out of 10. It's good. Okay. So, All right. so 10 out of 10 for Kamek, 6.5 out of 10 for me. That's our review of Coca-Cola Bite. Yeah. All right. Bite. Make sure you go check it out. It doesn't bite. Yeah. It's pretty good. But I'm not sure if they'll have this in stock by the time some people are trying to get this. But maybe, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. You know you have to subscribe. And also go subscribe to my dad. Huge shout outs for him being in this video. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Peace out.